Raise your right hand. You solemnly swear the evidence you're about to give is the truth, the whole truth, and nothing but the truth, so help you God. I do. Now, Mr. DeVoe, I'm going to ask you a question, and I want you to answer the jury so that uh, they can understand. Uh, yes, and what is that? You'd like for me to explain my tea? Your, your, your tea. Yeah, my, my tea. Uh, yeah, I would like you to explain your tea, and I would like you to do that in as plain language as you possibly can for our friends here. Well, I will try my best to explain to you, Juris. I could throw words and labels at all of you, but you seem like nice people. So I'm going to be open and honest. I have a man's toolbox. But everything else about me is pure lady. I love to dress in women's clothes. I love to go shopping. I love to have my nails done. And I love men. Any questions? Oh, and by the way, ma'am, I hope you don't mind my saying, blue is definitely not your color. Okay, okay, okay. Now you want to know what I do for a living? Ask me. My time is very expensive, Mr. McMillan, probably more than yours. I get $500 an hour. How much do you get? I get $400 for a straight lay, $300 for a hand job, and $500 for a head. If you want to wear my panties, that's another $100. You take him home, Mr. McMillan. That's another hundred. No whips, no ropes, no spikes. I've got liquor and grass. Anything else, you bring your own. It works like this. You call me up. I make a date. I look you over. And if I like you, I make a deal. And darling, I am worth the trouble. Take my word for it. If you want the best, do you want the best, Mr. McMillan? I am talking about taking your body to heaven and sending your mind south. Do you like that, baby? You get what I'm telling you? Do you all get what I'm telling you? Well, the truth is, I didn't have a nifty childhood. Child, I ain't even finna go into all that stuff right now, honey, because I'm a, I'm a, I'm a tad bit, honey, heated, okay? How the fuck any one of you go question my right as or my validity as a as a transgender woman? Where was you when I was going through my situations in life? You went nowhere. So don't come telling me about the, you, these activists with this. Don't come acting like you're standing for me because I'm that girl. I'm the sex worker. I'm in the sex business, and then you say demeaning shit as if as if I feel some kind of way because oh well, you you're in a business to where it wouldn't bother you because you you live up to the stereotype. The stereotype of what? The stereotype of what, bitch? Because they feel like tranny, transgender women are in the adult entertainment business. They sex workers. They are. Even when you wasn't, you was a sex worker. And if you was a stupid asshole, if you lay down and don't get no money for it, you a dumb bitch. You a dumb bitch. And this coming from a tranny. You a dumb ass tranny. He has fooled you into assuming that he think that you are real. You are a real woman. And you sitting up here with shoulders wide as my back window back here. Shoulders wide as this window. And you, you hoes think that you can break me down and make me feel some kind of way because you feel like that, that I am a, a bad per, uh, interpretation of a transgender woman. I ain't doing nothing that no human being, fuck transgender, fuck, fuck whatever. I ain't doing nothing that no human being on this earth ain't doing. I am surviving. I am a hustler. I am an entrepreneur, so it just happens that I fell into the sex business. And so what if it's if they think that transgender do X, Y, and Z, okay? I applaud the nurses, the doctors, the transgender lawyers, all of these things. You get what I'm saying? I applaud everyone for what they do. I don't knock anybody for nothing that they do. Am I right or wrong? Am I right? I feel some kind of way when you deny me food. When you deny me housing, when you deny me health care, when you deny me these things, like I said yesterday and I'm saying it again today, it ain't what you call, it's what you answer to. And if you sit up there and answer to the term training, then guess what? That's what your ass is. And I'm out of here because I'm hungry and I'm finna eat. Ciao.